you know what day it is? It's Catterday. Let's look at the Catterday deck. Woo! Esper, that little key is quite. Ear Kinesis is quite the awesome, interesting, and scarily powerful uh, attack. And we get to use it for free because this little Meowth becomes a Persian. And Gathering of Cats lets you ignore all energy on your Pokemon that have Catterday attacks. So Esper gets to do all that damage for free. But Esper needs to do a lot of damage. And by doing that, this little cutie does 20 to a bench Pokemon. And then Meowstic is in here. Perplexionize can be useful when you're in a pinch, especially against an active. Since... Esper does benches. But we need to do damage. We need to spread damage for Esper to work. And that's where coughing and wheezing come in. And Roxy is our main draw. He can draw a lot of Roxy. And by drawing off a lot from her, you get to do quite a nice bit of damage by discarding said coughings and wheezings. Ditto's there. He's going to fight you to help out with the evolution stuff, the stage ones. And then we have... Cute little Cinchino for drawing. I feel like I don't use it as much as I should, but I feel like I use Zashian more. But they're there just for draw, even though he's still a sitting duck. Mew, how you doing? Still a cat, in a way. <laughs> and to help protect your bench, because you don't want them doing stuff to you with your weak little Pokemon here. Fiona, to help force an active that has damage on him. Force that onto the bench and then knock it out. Boss order to just one to help do the same. Spell tag, obvious choice. You want to spread damage. It's a good way. It's a good way to spread damage. And in one of the battles here, you get to see it kind of spread fear. It's like, if I attack, and I do this. I have two horror energy. Sure, the two damage is nice, but mostly because I've been against players, and I think there's a deck on here that I've uploaded where I played against, and I won because they had a Pokemon out. You get rid of the Persian or something like that, and they couldn't attack. And I like to use it for Mew. Mew can still attack with one energy. So I have that there as a reason for that. For that one energy attack. You have Lily's Polka Doll to help, you know, stall. Switches Balloons to help. I figured I'd throw in a Switch because there's times where you get stuck out. They throw something out there and you're like, crud, I need to get them away from there because Esper needs to come out. And then you don't have much for retreating. Here's the rest of the stuff in there because you need who you need at the right time. You need to draw Roxy. The incense helps get out those wheezings. Lure Bar helps to get back those wheezings. Basically is what those for that he can reuse Roxy again. And Rod to shuffle back in Pokemon to get back for, you know, Roxy. A pal pad to shuffle back Roxy's. You're going to use Roxy a lot. <laughs> that to help out too. Bring back in case you lose a thing. Adventure Bag also to help out in case you, you know, need to get that spell tag out. But Persians Gather Cats is amazing. And this cute little Esper is very scary to go against when things start working out with this spread damage thanks to everything here. So it's a fun deck. It's a good deck. And again, great draw support with Roxy. And again, Spell Tag and the Horror Energy is there because Mew can attack then to add that little bit of damage you might need just in case. And... Just in case, you know, you need someone to attack and you have like, oh crud, now I have no one to attack because I have no energy. I've seen lose a lot to that. So let's get to it. Show how crazy this deck is. But first, hey cutie, but first, <laughs> let's show off what deck is next. Hmm. Alright, let the match begin. <laughs> Alright, let's see if we can luck out here. She's going to get to show off my coin it's a litten coin you know litten the kitten because he's a cat mew too as the box because psychic and he's also kind of a cat and then the sleeves just because i want to show off those you know want to use those cool new sleeves we got from the tool kit the trainer's tool kit onto a good shuffle and start la 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 oh oh my <laughs> all right all right little Esper, I guess we'll put a little Esper out. I feel like we have eh, a struggling kind of thing here, but at least that Ditto can become our Persian. But we have Roxy, but oh, well, all right then. Yay. I don't even know what was even going on. <laughs> all right. 
Let's uh, look for another one here. Oh, good. Let's start again. Hey, there's Litton. Hey, you can see? Cat-themed, in a sense, for everything to go off the deck. If only it had cat sleeves. I guess I could have done Mewtwo and Mew, technically, but... Eh, I wanted to try out these new ones here. They're cool. All right. We have Esper again. We can always grab another Esper. <sighs> and I feel like... Maybe just in case someone does attack me, put the spell tag on and the horror energy. I know it's supposed to be a zero energy deck, but I, I believe... But that's just me. The it's It's fun for the gimmick. It's, it's nice to say, hey, this is a zero energy deck. Blah. But if, sure, if you want for fun, but if you really want to try and win a little bit, there are going to be times, and I've gone through Catterday decks, where they're just like, ah, oh, crud, I wish I had an energy to attach and then remove, or to put on again. What I've seen many times, I'm like, ah, oh, you know who you could have attacked with? Mew. You could have put that on the Mew, dropped the three damage cutters off, and then you would have been, you know, you could have done something to me. But then I kept on forcing them where they couldn't do anything with other Pokemon. So, kind of sucks. And still, the scary thing is, people can always boss his orders out. The cat. Even though, for some reason, when I played against a lot of decks, no one ever seems to want to boss his order out the Persian. Which I feel like, you should, you should get the Persian. Because without the Persian, then Esper is like, uh-oh. <laughs> But I'm rambling. All right. Got an interesting deck here. Cute little Charmander. And uh, we're going to have a... Interesting. Yeah. So... Uh, uh, just kind of sucks to have one Roxy. Put on him. What? I do need the draw. But then I guess... Much better. It was good a thing I waited. It's not like that damn it, one damage counter I would have done would have done like really anything. And I feel like oop, screaky. And I feel like I don't know. I feel like they're not really going to do that much to me. I mean, we may get the rare candy and Charizard here, but um. I, I don't know. My chair is screaky. <laughs> so yeah, just because... I know it's the gimmick, but I feel like... It's only just two. But I feel like because they do do damage counters too, that could help. And you'll see in this that a lot of those damage counters could be the make it or break it. You might see a time where it's like, hey, if you attack my little kitty, those... Two damage counters are going to be enough to knock you out. And it's happened. My favorite scenario is when you have that. And uh, the spell tag. And then they're like, oh boy, you're going to do this to me. And then those other damage counters are going to go knock someone else out. It's like, yeah, it's going to be fun, isn't it? <laughs> See like I'm doing here. I think we're setting up here to take a good knockout. Put him there because just the same thing there. I don't feel... Too upset, we'll get rid of the two Weezings. Weezing! Oh, uh, jeez. <laughs> yeah, we might as well. I'm gonna have the Evolution Incense here to make do. I finally get to use my little Cinchino. I hardly use them. Because I feel like this deck goes through a lot. The other trouble this deck is you can go through your deck a lot. I've lost a couple of games where I'm like, yeah, crud, where the opponent's just like, huh. You know, I can survive this if I just don't do anything. You know. You know, force something out and then... You know, you're down to like two cards and you'll just wait till you deck out. I'm like, ah, crud. <laughs> <sighs> yeah, so again... We'll just see what happens. Thank heaven for the Dow. Ooh, Absol. No, my Pokedell is going to have an extra treat cost. Oh, wait. <laughs> oh, boy. So, yeah. All right. So, this is Catter Day. I guess right now the cats are taking a nap because I'm not getting any of my cats.
Must be taking a nap on this fine Saturday. Or maybe they're not one to come because maybe this is a Monday. If this is uploaded or not. If not, maybe they think it's a Monday. You know cats hate Mondays. They love lasagna, though. <laughs> but this deck here, these are some powerful pussy right here. There's a lot of powerful pussies in here. Can I say that jokingly? But, whew, all right, let's see if I can get something out of the draw. Because, like, right now, look at the cards I have in my hand. And just, just discard more and draw six. All right. So, as so we get out of this, why, well, yes, I like to put some uh, damage counters on them. Yes, again. Boom, 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 and a boom. <laughs> Quick ball, let's get ourselves uh, some kitty cats out here, because I know it seems very hard to get these cats out. Again, you know, are they Garfield? <laughs> it's like, either the cats think it's they're Garfield, and they, you know... They don't like Mondays, and this is this uploaded on a Monday, or do they think it's a Monday? I mean, give us some lasagna or something, or are they just taking a nice cat nap, you know? <laughs> so let's get two Roxies back. <laughs> perfect. It's perfect. Nya -nya. Nya -nya. I don't know. Just trying to figure out some time there, and I think we should be good on the next toy. Wouldn't you say so, there? Oh, my chum! Meow, that's right. Okay, any other cat stuff? I don't know. <laughs> Heathcliff, Heathcliff, da-da-da, da-da-da, da-da-da. Suffering Thuckatath! What's going on? What are taking them so long? They're gonna have to hit that polka doll sometime. Oh, father... Oh no, reset stamp! <laughs> oh, oh, yeah, that's actually a good hand there. We're gonna get our Persian. Persian! And then uh, we'll get our cute little Esper who's seen things. Ah, oh, he's so cute. He sees into your soul and he's gonna kill you! Annihilate you! That's what he does! That's what I like about the deck. It's fun either way, you know. Win or lose, it's a fun deck and it can take on some of the best of them, so that's. A pretty amazing feat in its own. Cat feet. He. <laughs> feet. Yeah, they got like nothing in there. All right. So yeah, it's Neko Day. Necker Neko Day. Oh no! <laughs> And uh, because of Absol, I'll just put out the polka doll because I can't put out my bloom guy. Put that on you. On you. Put that on you. <laughs> and we finally got our Persian. Come on, cats. Gather around. That's a gathering of cats. Wow. And I guess with a little gown here, I guess I'll do something here think I really want to knock out that Savali. I think I'll be able to because of our fun little tech option because he's their draw support I don't need you now I don't have a Roxy yeah I'll definitely think that's the best way to go If worse comes to worse, I can always make do if I really need the draw. Yeah, we're gonna go with Fiona. Keep wanting to say Monafi. <laughs> the Fiona. Hold the Fiona! Dun dun dun. Alright, he should know that Silvala is going down by this little kitty. This little yawning kitty. That's a little tan here. What should I be? Basically, what they're probably thinking. There's so many ones to get hurt by my kinesis from a cat. Meow. <laughs> Goodbye, your draw support. No more disc reload for you. Hey, meow stick. Comes in handy. Because when you can't just get to that no good punk 
on the bench. You can do 70, and then... Better watch out, because, you know, they can't knock it out. Which is surprising sometimes when they can't. They're gonna, their weakness is going to be psychic, so... Mm -hmm. <laughs> so, like, right now, Meowstick would knock out that Charizard. I wouldn't have to do anything to the bench. Because I need to do 70, and Charizard is gone. My poor kitty. <laughs> Putting you out. <laughs> let's see if we get anything out of this first. Yeah, let's get Roxy. And then uh, Lure Ball. Let's get some Weezing back. Nice. Two kitties down. Two kitties to go. Why, yes, we have no bananas. <laughs> Why, yes, I would like to put some damage on everybody. Mwah! Spread damage like this is annoying. I like the Wheezing Coffee Roxy combo. It helps out with those spread techs, and it's good draw support. It spreads the damage, and you get draw support. And in certain decks, it isn't where it's not clunky. I'm looking at you alone, Sand Slash. I'll make you work sometime, someday. I'll get you next time. Next time. Because there's a cannon there. So. I want to think this out. Because if I do Psy Power. Put that on you. He can't put any more fire on him. Or else he'll knock himself out. <laughs> ha! And then I'll put 40 on someone back there and knock him out. Yeah, that sounds like a plan. Alright. What we gonna do today? <laughs> so we're gonna have to... welder and at least uh, you know one welder it'll do the minimum and that'll knock out my mew hey roxy <laughs> so let's see this is a long uh this is a long uh battle gotta get another charge are going so i wonder what they're gonna do they're gonna knock them out okay okay Give me a prize. I, that's a way of switching out your Pokemon. I guess they couldn't switch them out. So they gotta do new Charizard. Knock out Mew. Ha! <laughs> I love it. And then uh, take out that little Charizard maybe? Or take out the Slugma? Ha! <laughs> I like this. Ooh! Hoo -hoo -hoo -hoo. Well, Cephalon has entered the ring. Hmm. I might want to just start working on him. <laughs> I really don't see him as a threat. Honestly. Oh, no! Mew! <laughs> no, I knew that was coming. I Mew that was coming. Oh, yeah, he had the... See? I get to do more damage to him. I forgot I had that. Where to put that 40? If I put 40 on him, then I can have Meowstick come out and then knock him out, and then there's no more Charizard. No more Charizard, no more Charizard. But we could also win this <laughs> by putting... No, you know what? I think I can do this. Some dam putting some damage. Hmm. Looks like they're not gonna do anything to my. 
Persian, so. Let's see, I still have two rocks in there, two of those spell tags. I'll get ditto. I, I, just in case they do take up my Persian. Ah, just not getting who I want to get. But it's better to be safe than sorry. Because I can get Persian out next turn. Just wish I could do more damage. And knock out him. But, we'll knock out someone else. Or do that, and then he will be knocked out. What does he got? 120? 60 more damage on him, I think, will be fine. Eas easily fine, I'm pretty sure, because if I can get a Roxy, he'll go to 40 damage away, and I'll put on Spell Tag. I think we got this. My little S pool, my little pool, little kitty, my poor little kitty is gonna go down. I think we'll be fine. Okay, I was like, don't glitch on me now. <laughs> don't glitch on me. I'm pretty sure we got this. Hey, just what I need a Roxy. Roxy. Da -da 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 -da. Roxy. Look at that. Six cards left in my deck. Whew. <laughs> Oh, yeah, I think we're good here. What, what, what I'll do is, because I don't have my other kitty, yeah, we'll put down me out just in case, or... Yeah, let's get me out stick out. Because we can knock out Charizard. And then, yeah, we knock out Charizard. I put the spell tag onto the meow stick. And... Our guy right there is going to go down. Just in case. And, uh, yeah. Charizard goes down. And then we just got to knock out our buddy Blacephalon here. And, uh, this is pretty much it. If they can't get rid of my spell tag, then that is TTFN, ta, -ta for them. I have seven cards left in my deck. But Catterday, a win for Catterday. A nice win to show off. Doesn't win all the time, but when it wins, it is awesome and it's annoying. And I like the idea of it. And it's a fun deck. Let's just spread a little bit more damage on there. Charmander goes bye-bye because of that. And Slugma goes bye-bye. I didn't even have to do anything. That's a win. Yeah, we took out some big Pokemon. Good job, little kitties. Little kitties taking on big, bad Pokemon. Hope you like the deck. Uh, like, share, subscribe, support. That'll be awesome. Uh, see you next time. This has been... Professor... Tissajou. <laughs>